what up what up my dance babies welcome back to another video with hbcu dance scenes so today's video as you guys can see by the title will be about the beautiful elkon golden girls yes so golden girls golden girls let me tell you something about golden girls golden girls will definitely buck you down they will buck you down to the ground. I feel like um, a lot of people compare them to um, the J sets, the Prince and J sets from um, Jackson State University. I think they are kind of similar, but in a way they're very different. I feel like J sets are more of a mm, technical team, and I feel like the Golden Girls are more fun and exciting and hard and and bucking i don't think they really care too much about technical but i think you do have to have some technical abilities but it's not like a mandatory thing for their team in my opinion i do feel like the golden girls bring a different flavor to the hbcu dance world I feel like with the Golden Girls, they just have a certain type of spunk with them. They don't really care. You know, I don't think they have like that. I don't care mindset. I'm here to have fun. Whatever it is, we're going to do it. As long as it's fun and exciting. And, you know, you could just tell by the way they dance and the way they just look. So, on to this first performance. I have been noticing there are a lot of um, YouTubers band pages like Trent Productions, Showtime Web, MF Cool Productions. I noticed that they posted um they just posted the Golden Girls dancing on the hill or they just posted them marching in somewhere. But I'm not sure if it was a game or not. But I just want to talk about the performance and how they dance on the hill and them marching in. Um in my opinion I do feel like it could have been a little more cleaner when they dance i know that this team um can bring a lot of heat and they dance very hard but i do feel like kind of clean it up a little bit you know i'm not saying that these ladies didn't do what they had to do or they didn't look good but i do feel like it could have been a little more precise the moves but then it is kind of hard when you're marching and you're on a hill and you're, they're probably really hot. So I understand that. But um, that was really the only complaint I had. Also, I just love the way their uniforms look. I love um, Elkhorn's colors. That purple and gold is so beautiful. And I love it, especially on our African-American young females like purple just look good on us and then purple represents sorority anyway so you know it's only right that it be on my beautiful black women also the hair was really good i do feel like um a lot of hbcu dance teams especially this thing that's they look very clean and look very precise because of the way their hair is or the way their uniforms are it's like everyone looks the same and i do feel like when everyone looks the same it just makes the team look better overall even if the team is not dancing as precise as long as they look good i feel like your looks is a very big part of dance right it's not just all about dance, about the hair, the makeup, the whole nine yards, you know. I do feel like all of their hair should should be the same. But I don't know who their their sponsor is and their coach, you know. I don't know how things going on over there um, in Elkhorn's world. But yeah, everything else was pretty damn good. I loved it. I enjoyed the show. I always did like this team. They just bring a different type of funk into the HBC world. So if you guys like this video, make sure you throw a comment down below. Tell me how you feel about it. Make sure you subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Okay?
Thank you. Bye.